What is uh, one thing that teachers do to make you feel appreciated or welcomed? I mean, probably just talking to the students, like especially if you're slacking or you've got a bad grade or you don't look like you're having a great day, just talking to the students. Probably when I do things for athletics with the coaches, for the coaches. It's probably the time where I feel like useful and so. Like yeah. If you could live a day in the life as one of your teachers, which one would it be? Miss Spear. Why she's she's so cool and she's just so like smart with math that like being able to be her smartness for one day would be really cool. And so. I love her stories. She's so cool. Yes, she's just such a cool person. So I'd probably have to go with Miss Minjwa. Why? I'd love to be a theater teacher. So that way I can just make fun of people. <laughs> nah, but because I thought that would be a really fun thing to do and just, I love acting. It's one of my favorite things to do. And so I love being a director. Mizzy. Why? <laughs> because I feel like she's always stressed out, which is, I would help her like, if I lived in her life, I'd like calm down a little bit. And I think her job's super cool, so. Coach Flick. Why? Because I feel like he's most like simplest one to do, just sit there. <laughs> What is one thing that this school has helped you realize about yourself? Like? High school's hard. I <laughs> uh, wasn't expecting it to be as difficult as it is, even though I take the harder classes, try to take the hardest classes, so. Um, probably that, like, I'm a hard worker and I can do things on my own uh, without having to have, like, a group help me because, like, when they assign homework or whenever they're like, do this by yourself, you know, that kind of, like, just helps me grow as my like own person. So. What is something uh, you appreciate your teachers doing? Dealing with us when we're being like too obnoxious at times. Just talking with me because sometimes I can have a really bad grade and they'll do their best to help me and like improve that. Especially like with my coaches. Really um, answer all my questions whenever I need help and they explain um, because sometimes I just get really confused especially like math, yeah, so. Um, I like that for the most part, like our teachers are allowing us to like work together as groups and we can really talk to each other and um, like just be very student involved. Um, our school is very like, really wants to know about our student opinions and stuff like that. If you can retake a class um, because you loved it so much, what class would that be? Um, probably rotations because I got to go up to the hospital and um, that was just a really great experience for me. Geometry because I was really good at it. Which teacher inspires you the most? Um, again, Ms. Z. <laughs> um, she's just like, I've been with her since freshman year and she's um, helped me like grow in my journalism ways and everything that I want to do. Um, she really prepped me for like my career after high school. So. And then, do you think it's difficult being a teacher? Oh yeah, 100%. I mean, students aren't nice, like, at all. Like, I would agree <laughs> that even, like, the good kids cannot be amazing at times. So um, I think it would be really hard. And then plus you have to deal with not only kids, but also adults at the same time. And it's just rough. <laughs> Thank you for all you do and for putting up with us because I know high school students are no easy um, task. And I'm sorry that some people are immature and rude <laughs> to y'all because y'all don't deserve that. So thank you for all you do, and I know we're a pain, but thanks for like sticking with us as students and um, preparing us for college, even though we may not like understand it right now. Love y'all.